You can copy and paste a feature. This can save time in cases where you have similar features. In this example, I'll demonstrate copying and pasting this keyhole, which actually consists of two features. You can select the command or the features first. The command is located in the top border bar, Menu, Edit, Copy Feature. Simply select a feature or features to copy. Note that there is an option named Add Dependent Features to add child features. In this case, the keyhole is formed by a sketch and an extrude. Clicking OK copies the features into the clipboard, after which you can paste them. I'll click Cancel instead and demonstrate picking the features first from the Part Navigator. With this method, you have to explicitly select all the features to copy, but remember you can easily see the dependent features by the blue font in the Part Navigator. I'll hold the Shift key and pick the sketch and extrude features. With the features selected, you can either press Ctrl-C or right-click and select Copy from the pop-up menu. After copying the features to the clipboard, you can then select the Paste command. It is also located in the top border bar, or you can simply press Ctrl-V. Both the dialog and the window named Original Features displays. The References pane lists the references that need to be defined for each feature you are pasting, and the necessary selection step displays for the selected reference. First, I need to orient the coordinate system of the sketch. There are three references. I'll first pick this face to place the sketch. Selecting the second reference, notice a vector displays in the Original Features window. This is for your reference. I'll pick this edge to define the same vector on the new face. The next refer reference is now selected. Now again, note the vector and pick an edge. The references are all satisfied for the sketch, and there is just one reference for the extrude, the target body. I'll pick the solid. With all the references satisfied, you can then click OK to complete the paste. The two new features are added to the model history and are independent of the original features. I'll edit the sketch and change the size of the keyhole. If you wanted, you could also link the expressions to the original expressions, so they are always the same size. It's worth noting that you can also paste the features into a different part file, and when you copy another feature, it overwrites what is currently in the clipboard.